Hello and welcome to this episode of Packet Tracer. In this episode, we want to discuss structured cabling here in the physical workspace so that we can have a more realistic representation of cables in the physical workspace. Let's get started. First off, I want to create a few bend points on these cables. Now you can see that using bend points, I have more flexibility to move these cables in different ways. If I try to bring one bend point on top of the other, then we have a group point. Now this black cable represents a group of cables. I can create a bend point on that black cable as well by double clicking on that cable. Now an additional bend point is created and I can move this group of cables all at once as if it was just one cable. Now let's go and color code each one of the cables so that we, we can differentiate between each one of them. For this one I want a red color. You can see that each one of our cables have their own color at this time and we can differentiate between each one of them. Remember that a group of cables is always represented by a black cable and we cannot really change that. Now I want to ungroup some of the cables. I will come to the delete tool, I will click on top of this cable as you can see that I have the ability to ungroup cables one cable at a time or I can ungroup all of them at once. You can see that I mistakenly deleted one of the cables in this group. Let's ungroup one of the cables first and we can move the cable from there to here. Now you can see that the cables are ungrouped. Now let's delete all of the bend points and make the cables straight. You have to be very careful, otherwise you might delete the cable itself. Let's go and create another bend point in here, almost in the middle. And let's check the information about this cable. You can see that we have the source device information, the destination device, and we also have the cable length and the total cable length. The cable length is from one bend point to another. So from here, to, from PC0 to this bend point is called the cable length. And the total cable length means from PC0 to the next device. If I come here, you will see that the cable length is 12 and for this cable it is 14 but the total cable length is always 27 meters. I can move this device far away and increase the cable length. Now you can see that it's 81 meters. Let's zoom out a little bit and bring this device even further. Now you can see that the connections have gone down. You can see the red triangles, they represent a down connection. It is because the cable length has become more than 100 meters and you know that for copper cables we have the limitation of 100 meters. I can control the effect of cable length by coming to the preferences and disabling this preference, enable cable length effect. Now it will have no effect at all and the connections are up once again. And that's it for this episode everyone. I hope this has been informative for you and I would like to see you in the next episode. Stay tuned.